Let's go ahead and pick a paper space layout right there. We'll do the ANSI A landscape. And if you do not see your viewport, you can turn it on or thaw, thaw it. Double click inside the viewport to activate it and then set your scale. We're going to put it at one to one here and then pan. As soon as we do that, let's go ahead and lock it up. Double click outside the viewport to return to the layout paper space and then I'll freeze the viewport. Now, I'm going to also go to the page setup for this layout. Create a new page setup here. We'll do letter PDF. For the printer, we'll use DWG to PDF. Uh, paper size, 8.5 by 11, as you can see there. And then we'll do extents, center. We already have the scale in the viewport. We're just going to use the one to one scale here in paper. And then our color table, and I'm going to check display plot styles here too. Then click OK. Or actually, let's do a preview. So make sure we have the right orientation. Uh, exit. Click OK. Make sure it's selected. Set it current to apply it to the layout. Close. Now you should see everything in black and white because we have those plot styles selected. Now we can zoom in and go ahead and adjust your title block information. I'll let you go ahead and do that on your own. All right, just make sure you have your name, date, and scale correct. Once you've done that, then you can go to your output tab, use preview one more time, right click, and plot it. Remember, you're going to plot it and save it to your uh, directory. So here's my DC16 single views. Here's the PDF folder. Give it a proper name there. This is number four. And save. And that'll complete production of problem 2-4.